Okay, going to check the orders. Looks like Jessica Lowe needs her central line dressing assessed. It looks like it was coming loose. So I'm going to gather some applies. Hi, Jessica. My name is Allison. Hello. How are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing good. Can I get your name and your date of birth? Uh, Jessica Lowe, March 18th, 2001. Awesome, thank you. And do you have any allergies? I don't. Okay. Um, so I was notified that your dressing on your central line um is a little bit loose. Can I take a look at that? Yeah, for sure. Okay, awesome. Take a look. Yep, it does look like it's a little bit loose. So is it okay if we go ahead and change that um central line dressing right now? Yeah, for sure. Okay, awesome. Have you had a central line dressing change before? I have. Okay. Let me just remind you of um, a couple of things with this. Because it's so close to your heart and it goes directly to your heart, there is a high risk for infection. And so we're gonna do a lot of things to maintain um, cleanliness and sterility. It is gonna be a sterile procedure that I'm gonna do. And so I'm gonna have you wear a mask and I'm gonna wear a mask. I'm gonna turn your head a little bit um, and then I won't be talking during the procedure, okay? Okay, sounds good. Okay, but because this is um, a clinical pass off, I will be talking. In practice, though, I will not be talking. Um, and then I just wanted to remind you, after we have that done, to keep the dressing clean and dry and just make sure if it is gets loose or soiled again, um, like it did uh, today, to just let us know and we'll go ahead and change that. Um, and then um, in case of an infection, some of the signs and symptoms of an infection are like getting a fever or feeling like really hot in that area having that area be red or swollen. And so if any of those happen, um, just let the CNA or me know and we can call the provider about it, okay? Sounds good. Awesome, do you have any questions? Nope. Okay, great, then we will get started. Let me set everything up. I'm just gonna raise your bed. Is it okay if I put your head up? Yes. this mask. Okay. Just gonna turn your head this way. Make sure your hair does not get in this either. Okay. There you go. We're just gonna go ahead and start off by removing this old dressing. Oh, this glove is ripped. Since there's no blood on this, I'm just going to throw it away here in the trash. And I'm just going to assess the site. It looks like um, it's clean and, and dry. There was no blood. Um, and if there was any signs of an infection or anything like that, I would notify the MD. But since there is not, then we are good to go. Um, it looks like the catheter is out a little bit. It's about an inch and a half out. So that's something that I will also document. Okay. 
Yes. And like that. ahead and put on my sterile gloves. So this is the one that we just have. We don't need this. And then because I didn't see any blood, I'm not going to use the alcohol wipes. I would click this, but since we're doing it on the mannequin, I'm not going to. Just jab this right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. I'm just going to do a little bit extra. Okay, I would have broken sterile because my glove just touched that. Um, so I would have had to change my gloves and um, got new gloves and performed this again. But I'll let that go. Okay. And I'm just gonna make sure this is right over.
What's today? The I'm gonna put your gown back up. I'm going to take this mask off of you, help you get back into your comfortable position. Okay, so let me lay you back down. So, and lower the bed. Alrighty, so um, Jessica, I just wanted to again remind you of the signs and symptoms of an infection, which are fever, um, having any rash or redness. If it hurts, if it's painful over there, then definitely let one of us know. Um, I also want to remind you to try and keep that area clean and dry. And if it does become loosened or soiled again, just let us know, just like you did. Okay, do you have any questions? No. Okay, awesome. Well, then I will get out of your hair. Um, your bed is down low, your side rails are up, and here's your call light right here, and your bed is in the locked position, okay? All right, have a good rest of your day. I'm going to document my orders.